friend, and, and Katie said, there's this really cute boy who, who is now in my grade, and his name is Bob. Well, she was Catholic, so... <laughs> so, I don't know, when we were teenagers, we knew one another. We would see each other at Madeline's Ice Cream Store, where Carol got fired because she gave too much ice cream cones. <laughs> cones were too big, so he fired her. And so then when he, I went in the Army, I asked his friend, Bob Opsall, how he was, and he said, I think you should write to him. So I did. And he answered. Aww. And so we corresponded, and then when I was at the end of my senior year, he came back from Germany, and we started dating on and off, and you know, we were young and kind of dumb. And, <laughs> and then I went, again, he went back into service, then we decided, well, maybe we shouldn't be seeing each other all the time. Well, that didn't work too well. <laughs> so he came home in uh, March, no, February, end of February, because he was going to OCS in, in Georgia. And on Thursday, we decided, well, we'll get married. <laughs> on Saturday. <laughs> so we went um, well we were, we went to the priest and and who was that? Father No. No, the other one. Harry. I know that was Jerry's brother that married them, but that was anyway. So he said, Well, I it's Lent, but we can make an exception. So we went, we, that was fine, and, and we said, Maybe you should have somebody there. Well, my parents were out of town, they didn't get there, and Bob's mother and dad did, and my sister Jane. His aunt, I guess that was it. Yeah. And uh, yeah. so we went, we were on our way downtown to get our marriage license on the bus because we had no car. <laughs> the way on the streetcar, right? And when we got to Dale and University, there was a streetcar strike. <laughs> so everybody off. So there we are in front of the Faust Theater. Wondering what we're going to do, and it's about three o'clock, and they close at four thirty. So it just so happened this guy came down the street and Bob him, and he took us down to the courthouse. <laughs> <laughs> and so uh, we applied for the license, and they said, "Well, you will have to have a judge sign it, or you can't. It's not legal because there's was a waiting time." So Bob went up one set of stairs, and I went down the other, and he couldn't find any judges that were there. And I found this guy who was just got off his chair. He was going to put on his coat, and we dashed in the room, and he said, you sure you want to do this? And we said, yep. And that was it. One <laughs> <laughs> long story. Not traditional. Wow. I have a story I kind of want to tell, like, 